Tonight's Whiz Quiz Contests are brought to you by the Tom All Family of Dealerships, Chrysler, Buick, Dodge, and Hyundai, the home of the Knock Your Socks Off deal, Road State College, committed to your success, RhodesState.edu, and by QB Hamburgers, the taste of Lima since 1928. Well, if you just joined us, we know Ada will be moving on. They'll eventually take on the winner of this game between Allen East and Versailles. Let's introduce you to our players right now. Joining us from Allen East, we have Ben Lees, Tim Dunn, Mason Duvernay, and Matt Meyer. And Allen East is coached by Clay Casey. All right, turning now to Versailles, James McClure, Amy Warden, Alexis York and Hannah Grillo. Versailles is coached by Margie Trion. Welcome back to all of you. Okay, you guys know how this goes. We have 10 questions in our first round, 10 points apiece. Get the buzzers ready. Please speak up and be as complete as you can with the answers, okay? Question number one, complete the World War II saying, praise the Lord and pass the blank. The buzzer here sounded first, so we cannot take any answers. The answer, though, is ammunition. All right, question two. Who was the number one U.S. flying ace in World War I? For sales. Uh, Eddie R Rickenbacker. You are correct. Eddie Rickenbacker. All right, number three. The U.S.'s military highest honor involves a gun salute of how many guns? Yes, that would be Allen East. 21. 21 is correct. What three states hold the most electoral votes? Allen East. California, Texas, and Florida. That is incorrect. Versailles, yes. California, Texas, and New York. That is correct. All right, moving on, number five. The Holy Trinity refers to what entities? Yes, Versailles. Uh, God, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit. That is in the, will we accept that? All right, we will accept that. All right, moving on to question number six. Who wrote the novel, The Member of the Wedding? That would be Carson McCullers. All right, number seven. Who was Chief Justice of the Supreme Court prior to William Rehnquist? Yes, that would be Ellen East. John Jay. John Jay is incorrect. For sales, do you want to try it? Yes. Sandra Day O'Connor. That is also incorrect. Warren Berger is the answer. All right, number eight. Which Navy's, Navy group's motto is, we build, we fight? Versailles. Navy SEALs. The SEALs is incorrect. Alan East, do you want to try? No. The CBs is the answer. All right, two questions remaining in your round one. The German dirigible, the Hindenburg, blew up in which U.S. state? Yes, for sales. New Jersey. New Jersey is correct. And your final question, round one. The Abrams, Bradley, and Hercules are what type of army vehicle? Yes, Alan East. A tank. Tank is correct. All right, we've come to the end of round one. And here's our score, Allen East with 20 points, Versailles with 40. That means Versailles, you're going to lead the second round. You have five questions and they're yours, but please buzz in with your answer. <coughs> Whose show was called the greatest show on earth? Yes. Uh, Barnum and Bailey. We will accept that. All right, number two. 
Which American painter was known for dripping paint on a canvas? Yes. Jackson Pollock. You are correct. If one takes the LSAT exam, what area does he or she wish to pursue? Yes. Language. Language is incorrect. Hopefully this is not what you'll be studying. It is law. All right, question four. What term means that executives are guaranteed benefits even if they lose their job? Yes. Owner's compensation? That is incorrect. The answer is the golden parachute. All right, here's your final question. Give the name of the rights read to a suspect by a police officer. Yes. Miranda writes. You are correct. All right, moving over to Alan East now for your five questions. Please buzz in with your answer. What is happening to the stock market when it's a bear market? Yes. It's rising. That is incorrect. Just the opposite. Stock prices are falling. Who created the Muppets? The answer is Jim Henson. All right, who was the presidential candidate for the Green Party in 1996 and 2000? The answer is Ralph Nader. All right, two questions remaining in this round. Give the slang term for one that stays on the job when others go on strike. The answer is scab. All right, and your final question in the second round. Calpurnia, Hectate, and Gem are from what novel? Or Calpurnia, maybe. The answer is to kill a mockingbird. All right, we've come to the end of rounds one and two. Here is the score. Versailles, 55 points. Alan East with 20. We'll be back with our final round after the break. Don't go away.